All right, they are going into it. We're going to get Hero coming out here. And let's get Hero versus versus Robin. Now, as we know, like, Salem is the one rocking the Hero, showing that this character is indeed got So let's see what's going to happen here. And Goldeneye, you love this character. That's not magical commentary. You still love playing this character. And as we're seeing already, Accelerado coming out. Going pretty intense. Magical Dante, not a normal hero. That's trauma. Oh my god, but we get the into the back air angel with the combos and this oh this man. is even yeah, our tire the ledge. Oh my god. Magic versus magic, but doesn't matter. Angel trying to get this stock and just throwing the projectiles, but retreating the ledge here. Yeah, if you think about this, this is Robin versus more RNG based, slightly better Robin. <laughs> oh, back throw to send off. It's in a sense, almost that. a ditto. Oh, but gets the two frame with the down smash that has enough active frames. That is huge. That is huge right all now. All right, all right. Now Robin doesn't have the scary sword anymore. Oh my god, but now Salem's got to get this stock off. Yeah, that was almost a tech test situation. So it's interesting what Salem's doing. He's dashing in and then turning around, but then he can get a back air or something along those lines. Yeah, the hero's back air is significantly more powerful than forward air. And trying to throw those to swooshes right at the ledge where Angel has to recover. Ah, bounce! The, I'm now going to win this matchup button. Unless I take a sword for the face. Yeah, and, bounce and as it is though. Against Levin's sword. Still gonna get there. Yep. A great tech from Angel, but gonna get the forward air on the ledge, and that is it. He's like, you two frame me, I'll two frame you. Still uh, gotta get off this ledge though. Perfect. It's, right it's now, dope. both of them looking like their magics are going down. I mean, Salem's got 40 MP right now, and Levin Sword is going down. <laughs> yeah, but under for Angel. Hero's MP gets recharged any time he hits me. And naturally. Right. Robin's MP, you have to use all of it, get rid of it, then wait for it to recharge. <laughs> you know. Perfectly fair. Yeah. Right now, percents are climbing here, and this is looking much closer than that first stock where Angel got a really clean kill here, but tries to go for what they call checkmate in Smash 4. Not going to get it, but that fire hits him way the heck off stage. Yeah, well, there's a lot of stuff being thrown by Angel right now. Yeah, and right now, salem has got to get his way back. Back throw. If you can, if you can yeah. force Hero to use more of his magic points in order to stay near the ledge and trying to recover, that works better oh. in his favor. And that is so strong. Eleven Sword Neutral Air, new, a new addition in Ultimate. Very, very strong. Yeah, and uh, Sale was about to get the Crackle Slash off, possibly end Angel's life by freezing him. Yeah, right like this, though. Even, close, but you know, either way, going to shoot him off to the sky. News coming in. Didn't quite get it. Slight up, up throw, my back throw, pop. I'm not quite killing. Kaboom's going to kill him, though. <laughs> Kaboom with his vacuum effect is absolutely going to kill yeah, that vacuum hitbox is ridiculous. It's it's insane. And they made it so now it better connects, so it is indeed insane. Yeah. Okay, so last stock for each of them in this game. Right now, I think what Angel's gonna be going for is an edge guard, as we're seeing right now. He really wants to set up those frame traps and keep Hero off stage, because Hero off stage can do significantly less to him than if he's on stage. Especially because he's really in the corner, gotta get his way out. What? Is... Yeah, okay, especially because Tier of Magic Pool is currently training fast. And to get a good Kasu, she needs about 16 mana, I believe. Like 16 or 18. So if he can That's... put Salem below the 16 mana threshold, he can't do a full recovery. He can only get yeah, level right two. now he's at 14 right here. So, yeah, you are correct, but he does have that Oomph for Psych Up. Which one does he got right now? He's got Oomph because he hit him a couple of times. Oomph is the one oh, on fire. Last. Oh, he's almost out of mana, but gets the grab. That's exactly what he needed, and now he can recover one more time. 81 to 101 right here. Ooh. Oh, that sent him off with a really interesting angle. God, this is, this is really, really close, but you know Salem is running out of mana. Very and nice. He is short. out of mana, but gets the tech and the air dodge, so he air, he air dodged twice. He, he air dodged, but not also... only that, he was out of recovery. Yeah. Oh, man.
Yeah, that's what I was going to point out. If you notice, like, as he teched it, he threw the book away. So the air dodge was the only option he had. Yeah, so he teched, but wow. then he tried to air dodge, and he didn't get it. Oh, my gosh. Crazy last this scenario yeah. that we had here. Yeah, that was that was very well played by Salem to get the swoosh edge guard. Oh, my gosh. So, yeah, that's, that's a bit insane. Very exciting. Oh, man. First game here. Nailbiter. These are all best of five in our top 32, so they're running it back. Well, let's get into it here. I feel like running it back makes the most sense. I feel like both of them yeah. like FD equally, and I feel like the inclusion oh. of platforms have actually caused more problems. Is, unless, yeah, there's a, or, unless there's a comfort thing involved. Yeah, yeah so we'll or, see here. I mean, I... Like, I was going to say, like, there's always that counter-pick advantage that you got to factor in, especially for best of fives. And that's it looks what like I thought we was are about switching. To happen. That's what I thought was about to happen. I was like, if they're running it back, but Salem dished out, I think Salem was popping down to her, man. Yeah, so let's see what this one does now. I mean, again, these are not matchups that we usually see, so let's, uh, let's see what's going to happen here. Let me do my thing. <laughs> we my turn. Actually, that's something that I hadn't even thought about that probably gives Enderman a huge advantage right now. If he places a block down, that probably blocks any of uh, any yeah. of the uh, projectiles that Angel can throw out. Oh, yeah, but Robin not can't just, really, like, has to recover in specific any. ways. There's no hitboxes. Yeah, he, not just any, he can block all. Steve, or in this case, Enderman blocks, block a lot of different things. Now, percents are climbing here. It's still pretty even back and forth right now. But, yeah, I mean, like, Salem has yet. Well, that was something. Okay. Yeah, using the blocks to block the minecart progressions. That way you can just hit them. Yeah, and get the extra damage. Right now, Steve's still rocking the bro the wood sword. Has not upgraded. He is just intentionally doing things. And he detonates. Boom. So that, he down smashed. And I think there's a way where you can air dodge and avoid yep, the explosion. Very clean stuff that we saw there. That was... Now, Angels probably has experience against uh, Steve because this is a character that, like, every person on Wi-Fi started playing. But at the same time, then there's Salem, who plays this character <laughs> differently. Yeah, there's a difference between playing the character and playing, you know, a top player using that character. Gosh, so a lot of projectiles here. Along there. Such good patience to get through the ledge trap. Grab, gonna chuck him off. And good movement here from Angel. We see how he does these uh, B reverses and these ledge traps. Gonna get it, not gonna get the kill though. He's yeah, gonna have to quite. recover. Yep. I was about to say, he's gonna have to recover high if he wants to make the ledge. Didn't recover high, didn't make the ledge. Yeah, now 50% yep. on Angel. He's got work to do, but I mean, hey. Future King is making a box. Salem making a box. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> we know we know we know Mewtwo King plays his character as well. <laughs> oh man, using the fire to stall and going all the way out with the cart. Got, now we're seeing the reverse of what happened last game. You saw how much that uh, Salem was struggling to get MP and how much of a nail biter is. We're seeing here Salem is making Angel struggle to keep like all of his stuff. <laughs> Yeah, absolutely. And as I said before, minecart's probably going to be one of those things that's a huge factor here, just out of the fact that that's a zone breaker on its own. And when in minecart, Salem is going to be significantly faster than either of them are normally. So that's going to play a huge role in how he recovers and how he handles neutral. Got to yeah. get it back to the stage here. The sensor's still climbing. I mean, it can go either way. We know that Steve can die pretty easily from an edge guard, and Salem is making it extremely hard. And he's still using, I think the most interesting thing about this is that every other uh, Steve or Alex or Enderman or Zombie that I've seen, they always try to go for the gold tools or the, or at least the iron tools. But Salem is perfectly content sticking with, uh, sticking with the wooden tools and he's doing it well. So he's essentially keeping himself from being as strong oh. as he could be in favor of not having to deal with the timing of all that. Yeah. Uh, now he's going to be a ledge trap, but not going to get it there. And the percents are climbing here. Salem now behind. Got to get his way off of this ledge here. Thoron not going to get anything. Mm. Interesting spot to put the block, but okay. I think he was trying to go for, like, covering part fire as extended. Essentially. Mm. He's stopping a jumping approach. Fire. 
Very good right. dodge. See it here, gonna get him off with the Thunder. So the Thunder has more knockback than the Elf Thunder. The Elf Thunder does more damage, is always the style. Good stuff. And like this, we keep getting more followers in here. Welcome. And yeah, this is a nail biter nonetheless. Angel in the lead yet again. Salem Angel, gets to say, do you Angel like Angel may be in the lead, but if Salem can actually get in and get a good and get a good tilt or attack going. You can probably get the kill now that he has the diamond sword. He just, ran, he just rolled down smash rolled and got away with it because it's the first time he ever did that. <laughs> so, fun fact, Nexus Zero, he actually went hero game one. And that's why he's up a game right now. So he's Very good here. recovery, avoiding the ledge there, but going to get arc fired. What? Ooh, good okay. trade. That was good not a back trade. air, that just kind of so weird. Heavily in favor. Yeah, that was a trade and a half. <laughs> and like that... Game two going to Angel. We have already a very interesting first game here on the jet stream. Oh man, this is this is good, guys. This is some back and forth. We'll see what Salem wants to do here. I mean, because it's not that game was not as close as the first game with Hero. So yeah. we'll see what the stage counter pick is gonna do here. That's gonna be mm. I think the bigger factor. Because now first Salem's move. got counter pick advantage. Yeah, now if I if I know that I'm going to be going against some um, one of the Minecraft characters. I'm not gonna pick FD. All right. Yeah. Like we're no, oh, we're changing some things here. It's like we're not running that back just yet. Hold on, hold on. Personally, I think you should swap back to a uh, hero, but that's just me. Um, not saying the Enderman wasn't working, but yep, gonna be switching it back to the hero here. So let's get into working. the game three right now. saying that the stream is fidgety. Oh, I saw. I'm, I'm checking. Okay, so we're going to Town and City, but we're also going back to Hero, so... Yeah. 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 Ooh, up tilt right off the bat. Ouch. Yo, don't knock up tilting off the bat. No, I mean, that was... That was bam. <laughs> All right, but still, um, we're seeing it a bit more aggressive from both players right now, um, and I think that's just what needs to happen. Of course, still using all their projectiles, but they're being yeah. very on top of each other right now, and I think that's honestly good. Um, both of them have been playing kind of campy and a little bit slower in the last couple of games, and now yeah. they're just like, listen, you're going to play at my speed, and the other one's like, no, you're going to play at my speed. And it's like, well, well we're speed gonna are we going to now. play at? Yeah, exactly. All the Nosferatu, that is so potent. Yeah, that's, that's an important thing to get about that. Okay, so yeah, now we have Salem off stage, and he's gonna zoom. Oh, oh. <laughs> if, Angel, if Angel had just made a guess and charged an F-Smash there, that would have been bye-bye Salem. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So there's so for those of you who don't know um, about Robin, Robin has two um, endings of jab. Robin has uh, the green rapid jab, which uses the green book, which name I forget, and the uh, yeah, and the book. explosion final jab, like third jab, which is like the gentleman's kind of. And so the explosion one is actually really strong. Oh yeah, right? that one will kill you. That that was one of the scariest things about Robin, just in general. This character has some of the like if the opponent's at 130. Almost like all of their kit starts killing. It's it's just very very clean to getting a lot of that. So yeah, but as we're seeing, I mean, Angel understands that now he's got the lead and he is avoiding as much damage as possible. Yeah, it absolutely. Bounces out. Unfortunately, being off stage a lot means that Salem was able to get bounced. Well, Angel brings the sun. Brings the sun, bro. <laughs> Shield break. Not quite. He's got the no. He's got the he's got the red on him. I love I love. Ooh, that was a really nice back air, and at max rage too. So that was absolutely gonna take it. But now we have Angel a full stock above Salem right now, and at low percent. Oh my god, the combo! <laughs> what a nice combo! Ah! I love it. I love it. Oh, that spike. That was that was something. <laughs> For yet another spike, but he doesn't have any edge guard. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! 
That worked out the for plot. Angel. We call that a bait. <laughs> that was that was a bait, and then out of mana. Like what? Excuse me. Like that was. Oh. Oh. I mean, Angel. Angel was there. Ended up re-grabbing ledge, but avoided death, and then Salem <laughs> just kind of fell. So yeah. I mean, I mean, basically, what happened is Angel said tag you're it, and Salem said bet, and then like fell off the cliff while he coyote style. Yeah, that was yeah. that was something indeed. But uh, in any case, very excited as to what is next. As a reminder, all of top 32 are going to be best of five. So it's not over until it's over. And we keep getting new travelers in here. Welcome to the jet stream. We hope you Yay. like our content. We run a weekly on Wednesdays. And then we also usually run tournaments on Saturdays as well. So thank you all for coming in here. Big, yeah, big no, and shout just out. A, just a compound onto what Nick is in chat. He didn't run out of mana. He didn't fully charge his up. That's correct. Yeah, I wasn't sure. But yeah, you're right. He just didn't fully charge it and he hit the ceiling. Unfortunate. So. Yeah. He got the more. He got level two, which is more lateral movement versus vertical. So that oh, just okay. to the bottom of the stage. Yeah, and if you guys like our content, we have an active Discord. You guys can find it over there. We have matchmaking every single day. And now, Salem going for the tertiary, coming out with the snake. So let's get into it. Oh boy. Here it comes, boys. Explosions. <laughs> Explosions and other things. Explosions? Explosions. Colonel, I need more explosions. Got one question, and one question only. Explosions? <laughs> Getting back into it here. Right out of the gate, we're seeing a very different style from Salem, but Angel doing such a good job on capitalizing all these tech chases that he's been putting Salem into. Salem very much, like, getting any time that he rolls in he's getting red so this is gonna be hard yeah but right now uh w Salem went hero last game so so now we have a completely different so like snake is weird i'd like to say Zake snake is a zoner but is he really huh Snake is more of a defensive player. You try to get in on him, and it's, and it's a problem. But, God, not going to capitalize too much out of this. Salem has to find his way in right now. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, man. Yeah, I think the big thing here is, I'm, I'm not actually sure, but can um can grenades block things like Elf Thunder and like the fire and stuff like that? I believe so. They get so. in the way. Yeah, it just seems like it just seems like Salem now as playing Snake has a bunch of things that can very easily just get in the way of what Angel is doing. Be it the grenades that he's holding, the grenades that he throws out, the C4, uh, basically all of his projectiles, or just you know shielding and then up tilting when he, whenever Angel approaches. Yeah. Oh my God! Just keeping with the pressure and like this. I mean, it was looking pretty hard for Salem in the beginning, but now, now it's even. I was not expecting um, what he threw out. I was expecting the fair, and it didn't come out, and I was very surprised. But you know what? Damage is important. Oh my god, still keeping the pressure here. And yeah, I mean, we are seeing just this total change in play style from Salem is definitely making Angel have to adjust yet again. I mean, Salem has been fighting the same uh, play style through with Angel. It's, uh, we'll see. I mean, if Salem gets this game, it could be, uh, it could be the beginning for the game five, but we'll have to, we'll have to find out here. So many characters, indeed. I mean, if Salem really wants to, you could try Shulk or something. Yeah, I don't know that Shulk would be a bad idea. I just don't know how much experience he has playing Shulk against Robin specifically. Yeah. I think it's also the fact that just Salem just keeps getting caught in the traps that Angel's throwing out. That's the reason that, that Angel is doing so well, because Angel's being able to avoid a lot of what Salem's throwing out. And Salem's just getting hit by like 60, 60 to seventy percent of the things that an angel throws out. So it's just, it's just as easy as that to understand, really. God, the yeah, pressure dude. continues. Salem getting away with a double roll yet again. I mean, the percent's still climbing. It's not over till it's over. But yeah, this is, this is indeed like, God. I, I just it's, it's amazing how well Angel is maneuvering around all these projectiles. It really is. And he is feeling himself for today. He wants to get into that top eight. 
absolutely. I mean, wouldn't you? <laughs> I mean, of course, but oh, and he is alive. Okay, there's your answer. The grenade stops the thunders. I already knew the grenade stops fires. And the up tilt gonna stop everything. Well, let's go. <laughs> Arnie, up tilt, man. Hey, grenade can stop the fires and the thunders. That snake's up tilt is gonna stop the presses. Yeah, snake's up tilt is gonna stop you. It's just, that move is so good. <laughs> In the text chase situation, gonna get the damage. And this is still anyone's game right now. Very, very close. We're gonna see a game five. We very well could have moment. Now, right now it's basically even, so it, it kind of depends on whether or not Angel gets another one of those fire to fire to, to aerial combos, because those those kill really early. Yeah, like right. this though. Okay, Attacking. gonna keep. Oh, tries to get there, but the C4. What a move! What a Chad move! I didn't even see that. He just kind of he knew that till or uh, he knew Angel was gonna go for that back air, and he just double jump drop C4. That was a beautiful conversion there. I think and the C4 have... might have been there already. It was on him. <laughs> no, he, oh, he got the... I think that was a C4 with Punish. Yeah, I think he dropped yeah, the C4 definitely. and punished it over there. And I'm looking in here. We got a fro among few uh... subscribing yet again. What is up, homies? It is so good to have you here, man. Yeah, it's, it's wild. We got game five as our first match. Angel versus Dale. Now, Angel... One of, uh, someone I, I don't think I've met him personally, but people in our region definitely have, and, and this kid is insane, so, so glad we get to see him play here, and this is an insane first set. Yeah, I remember the first time I got to commentate for Angel, I think that was, was that Immortal Tech? It might have been Immortal Tech. Probably, I might have been, I don't know, was he around in the Smash 4 days? Um, at the very end, I think. It was definitely, I was definitely when we were still in um, Jupiter Hall in Crossgates. Uh, for those of you who don't know, uh, Jet right. and I are both from the Capital Region of Capital New York. Capital Region of the New York. Tournaments. I got to commentate him when I was a lot earlier in my commentating days. And just, man, he he makes Robin look top tier. I'm going to be honest with you, as it's he has insane. done this set too. Let's get back into it here. Game five, sticking with the snake here. Smashville. Oh, man, this can, this can go either way, guys. So the important thing about this being on Smashville is that Smashville is small, and so if either of them can have time to really set up their traps, they have a lot more. Uh, they have a lot less room to run away for, um, from those traps. And right. so, and we've seen some pretty good Robin play with <laughs> Animoria and things like that. But I mean, I, I just reflect back at what Angel was doing back with one of our earlier tournaments, and he, again, just really does make this character like when he gets in, he gets in hard. <laughs> Maybe Angel not got the a good best amount of work to I've do right seen. now. Got a good amount of work to do, but gonna get that grab. Gets the conversion. Gotta watch out for the C4 that's right behind him. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, something I learned from my PM, from my uh, Project M days, is that you cannot take your eyes off of where that C4 is, or else you will die to it. If you don't know where it is, you're playing the matchup wrong. That's my that's my take. <laughs> Absolutely. And there it is, that jab, so, jab, fire. Not enough to kill, but almost killed him at 119. And Thoron finally yay. connecting. Yeah, absolutely. So something I've actually noticed about what Salem is doing right now, um, when he ciphers like that and is trying to get above Angel, he should be going directly above Angel. Because with the exception of Angel, like, double jumping and up airing him, there's really not much that uh, Angel can do. So he can kind of just rain Hellfire down on him if he actually goes for it. Yeah. Bit of Angel to hold shield, bad of Angel to jump into the up tilt. I was literally tilt. about to say Adam. Angel's one up tilt away from death, and well, there you go. <laughs> Sometimes oh, in the snake matchup, I always feel like I'm an up tilt away from death, even at zero. <laughs> and more grabs here. Angel continuing with the combos, does not get the up smash, but dang. I'm not sure what that up smash was. I think that was supposed to be an up air, but he didn't get the jump out. It, it could have been hard to say. I mean, but going to get the back row here, going to set up again. And again, the, the thunders stall you in the air. He's so good at just keeping pressure. You don't know what he's going to do. Yeah. One thing I have not seen... There it is. Okay. I was going to say, one thing I haven't seen too, too much is the, is the charge cancels from Angel, but he's still working really well without it. 
Yeah, I think I think the thing is that he doesn't have to do much in the way of crazy movement. He's been getting on. He's been getting Whoa. on just fine with his double jump and with his uh, air dodges. Gonna get grenaded. Almost getting napalmed. Oh my god, that thunder was so important. He was in ledge trap hell. Yeah, does not pummel. That does not kill. Trying to hope for a uh, bad di. Now Angel, the one in the advantage state right now. Uh, Salem trying his best to reset neutral, but getting on stage against this kind of frame trapping machine is difficult, and in this case, kind of impossible as the roll is caught for a back air. Net up tilt almost coming in there, but not going to grab it just yet. This is very, very close. Uh, this is exactly what I like Ooh, to see. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bang! He did get <laughs> right. thunder. He did get arc thunder, but it was still one of those things where it's like, up, oh, yeah, this is worth it. I'm gonna <laughs> die. Let's just stop the missile. I, I was already gonna die. I might as well get the damage. God, this is so close, man. Oh, that almost killed. Salem, what are you gonna do here? This is... is so strong. Oh my god, and just Salem's got a lot of sneaky work that he's got to do with items, but now he's off stage. Gonna get the grab. On a forward throw. Okay, just get him off stage. I respect it. Yeah, do more damage. That's all. That's all you gotta do. Oh man. I am so scared for good tech. I am so scared for Salem right now. That felt a hell of a lot of patience. And that Salem, is though. not enough. No, that's not enough. He probably uh, kind of crouch canceled it a little bit. Oh my god. Mm. Uh, back throw, no pummels, not gonna kill yet. Uh, are we gonna see 200%? Taking all bets? Are we Are we gonna see 200% or death? Uh, I don't know at this point. Elm is trying so hard death, on the ledge. Also, Snake is at max rage, so a lot of things will kill earlier. Than oh, 72, he's bringing this yeah. back. Dude, like, this was looking so unhealthy 30 seconds ago. This is literally anyone's game. Insane. Oh my god. Rise the L Thunders, gets a Thunderbook, does not go it. Another grenade explosion, cooking the grenades. Oh my gosh. They're both, they're both extremely- Oh my gosh! Holy Unaware Jesus. of C4, apparently. <laughs> no, that was so many co options covered. Oh my god, Salem, almost at 200%, clutching that back. Um I oh think my the God. important thing to recognize about wow. that is just how good Salem is with his with his trapping there. Because and, Angel and how how like comfortable he is. He's been at high yeah. percents all the time. His mentality is insane. 